Hey everyone, welcome back, and here we are in our Skyrim save, wandering about slowly as we explore the lands. Now, I wanted to real fast give a thank you to my first Dingle supporter. Please forgive me if I uh, say your username improperly, but that would be Els Pietz. I hope I said that right, I'm sorry if I didn't, but thank you for uh, supporting me, especially on Christmas. That was a really nice holiday surprise, so thank you. Anyways, with that out of the way, let's continue our quest in our save of Skyrim. So, hopefully all of you had a nice Christmas. Um... This is the first time I'm actually doing a recording since, oh, quite a while, actually. I'm, I tried to cram as many as episodes as I could in beforehand as a sort of a uh, precaution, because I wasn't sure if I'd be able to do recordings over um, the, uh, the holiday, like, you know, the, the through the 22nd to the... 25th, but I'm actually doing recording today, so it's matter. Anyways, it doesn't matter. Uh, this is my first time recording in quite a while. So, here we are. I probably haven't played a video game since Friday. Well, I have played a couple video games. Um, I have been somewhat working on a couple things. If you missed it, I uploaded the first sneak peek of one of my projects on Twitter. So, there is that. So, if you want to see what I'm working on for one of the projects, or at least some sneak peeks, there exists Twitter images, and you can find the link for that in the description below. Now, this big boy wants to fight, and I'm not really sure if I want to partake in that. So, we're going to do some quick little maneuvers here. And just keep hitting them left and right. So he's getting a little close for comfort. So let's release the flames. Alrighty. Dead troll. Oh no. They're like orcs. When there's one, there's a hundred of them. Uh, I hope that all of you who are listening had a wonderful holiday season. And surprisingly, mine was actually alright. Um, my crazy grandmother ended up leaving town early to go up north so she could watch the Christmas, some weird, stupid event they do up north, but, um, some kind of, like, like, Christmas parade, I guess, that they do, um, up a little bit north, um, north of where I am, but south of where she is, so it's kind of this weird little halfway point. Anyways, she wanted to um, go see that rather than spending Christmas with her family, so that's where she went. So, yay. Anyways, we've got a troll to kill. So, I'm gonna try to avoid talking about, uh, family issues from here on out. Unless I end up doing a Draw My Life video or something like that. But until then, we're gonna keep family situations out of these videos. So, yeah. So this troll must not be very intelligent because he is fairly easy to dispatch with a mix of fire, fury, and arrows. We have made short work of him.
and I wasn't even using my good arrows. Anyways, let's continue. I'm really close to 100 subscribers. Um, it's kind of weird because I don't know if YouTube's like glitched out or something, but I think I'm actually like, I don't know. I might just be going a little crazy, but I don't know. It, it just seems like I'm like kind of um, like in limbo, I guess. You know, I've been stuck at like these like early like these like nineties numbers for a while. Nowhere near as long as oh, those are guards. I'm fine. As some of the other times, I think the longest feeling for me was definitely um, the thirties. Those were definitely the longest. Forties went by pretty quickly. 50s kind of crept and like struggled and then 60s 70s and 80s just zoomed by due to all of you recent subscribers tuning in and leaving your support which i cannot even begin to uh thank you for anyways um i really can't um, explain just how thankful I am for all of you who have been tuning in to my, uh, crazy videos and whatnot. How you can find anything in your hat that places beyond me. I'd rather spend more time in the mine than out of town. In this land here, the cities are house kings. I can't stand humans and their bickers. It's ridiculous. <sighs> Let's go return to Brynjolf. No, but like, it's just sort of um, kind of crazy that I have this many of you following me. And I really hope that um, once I finally uh, get past one of these issues I'm having with um, my current project, that I'll be able to start recording and production of the videos and then release them and hopefully that'll oh i'm not thief skilled yet then hopefully that'll uh, get my channel some attention so i don't know if it's necessarily unique or different or anything like that but um it's definitely different than what i'm what i've been currently doing which is recording gameplay and uploading it it's on an entirely different level and it actually somewhat shows that I may or may not have a brain in this empty skull of mine so which I, I might that might sound like an extremely shocking revelation that I actually have a brain but it is unfortunately the truth so He's got wicked sideburns. You need advice? Talk to Brynjolf. He's got better things to do. Judging from how well you've handled those shots we took, I see you've done more than simply prove yourself. We need people like you in our outfit. Dr. Philip, lock me in your blood. The telltale sign of a practice team. I think you'll do more than just fit in around here. What's on your mind? We've run into a rough patch lately, but it's nothing to be concerned about. Tell you what, you keep making a point, and I'll worry about everything else. Fair enough? Fair enough. Now, if there are no more questions, how about following me and I'll show you what we're all about? Let me show you the operation, then you can ask me questions. This kind of reminds me of Adventure Quest for some reason. I should do a, a sarcastic ASMR um, Adventure Quest Let's Play. <laughs> and I don't mean Adventure Quest Worlds. I mean the early 2005 Flash game that... Oh, I'm getting nostalgia right now thinking of it. 
that was single player. So. They were talking about bestiality. Before we continue, I want to make one thing perfectly clear. If you play by the rules, you walk away rich. I've already raided your house and robbed you. No debate, no discussion. What we say, then we do. Do I make myself clear? Don't talk to me that way. But yes, I understand. Estate is critically important to one of our largest clients. However, the owner has suddenly decided to take matters into his own hands and shut us out. He needs to be taught a lesson. Bring him what kind of armor are you wearing? Aren't you forgetting something? It's like a high level thieves' guild. So how do I get my cut of the spoils? Simple. Do as you're told and keep your blade clean. I can't turn a clock if I can. Why not? It doesn't matter if you don't. The hands aren't really around this stuff. And I'll be able to put some extra job to it once I do. Also, look out for Camellia in the platinum. Just like she offered in the new armor. <sighs> oh, come on. What's the catch? The catch is that you can't burn the whole place to the ground. That important client Merchant Link would be furious if you did. Makes sense. Right. The last thing we want to be doing is crossing our clients. What should I do about Ringoth? Maven prefers that Arangoth remain. Arangoth. Alright. You watch yourself on that island. Those mercenaries don't take prisoners. But I do not take prisoners either because I'm evil. That's not where I need to go. Is there anything you don't charge for? Look, at the end of the day, you'll find that all these characters Understood. are good. Here's your armor. Just make sure you put it to good use. Cool. Yeah, but I'm much more experienced and veteran than you. You're like a level 8, and I'm like a level 15. So, prepare to get schooled, chica. Alright. I need to make a couple stops first. Let's 
It's like my... You know what, dude? You wear my company's armor, or my company, my guild's armor, and yet you attack me. Therefore, you are an imposter, and you must face the pain of children. You're a terrible thief. Hey, buddy, I just want to sell my stuff to you because that's how things go. Um, you can have that. You can have that. And I have a decent chance that was probably. Mm. You can have a lot of this stuff that I don't want. Okay. Now let's go and disenchant all the items that we don't necessarily plan on using in the near future. Did you have an appointment? No. Was it a liver? I can't remember. I might need to keep that. That's kind of, I might need to keep wearing that. Um, but I don't need you anymore. I don't need you anymore. Uh, so instead of wearing that hood of prices, we're going to instead wear the helmet of bow damage. There's so much side conversation going on that's important that I couldn't care less about. Alright, time to go burn down an estate. Sanguine is the daydream prince of... I'm dyslexic and I can't read because I'm illiterate. Okay. Let's, uh... Yeah, turn those on there. Approximately... Like, what, two minutes to get there? I'd say, just from the parallax on the objective markers. Not even, it's right there. And now we're going to be taking elements from Subnautica. And swimming slowly. All right. Nope. Oh, my bow and arrow. Okay. Well, I may as well go in there immediately. There are guys I need to clear out first. I also have beehives to burn, so let's go ahead and do that. Okay, no 
bonus for having a sneak attack, I see. And they all know I'm here. Fantastic. Just fantastic. This is the exact opposite of what I wanted. How is that not a sneak attack? No, you. Guess what? Yes, I can. I don't know what you plan on doing. I'm invisible, boy. How is that not a sneak attack? This is ridiculous. You know what? I'm so disappointed that none of those arrows had a sneak attack damage on them. That's a really big no no. All right. See, I don't even need health potions against you guys. I can heal myself just by hitting you several times. Do you want to know why? Because my sword is vampiric in nature. Yeah, I'm trying to, but your island thing is not built for Khajiits. <sighs> right now, all you know I'm here. How about all of you just line up one at a time so I can cut you down like the thugs you are? Let's go. I'm not scared of you guys. Just let me get up here first. Mm, useless. So could I. There's nothing special about you. I don't know what you're planning on doing. Like, I'm literally stealing your life force as you attack me. Can you stop telling me I'm going to make a fine rug? Your buddy's dead. You're next. <sighs> you know, you could have lived your life. But nope. Instead, you shoot me. Yes, it is. Huh. 
Uh, where are those beehives at? They're up there. Oh, more of them? Actually, let's do it this way, shall we? I don't think so. It's time to go Super Saiyan. See, this is what happens when you attack someone who's literally just doing the game out of boredom and out of fun and not actually trying. They use a spell to heal themselves while they pummel you to death with their fists. Now that's being metal. Okay, I gotta like amp up my screenshot game because my my like last couple screenshots for Skyrim have been very very bad. Hmm. Oh, I'm so tired right now. <sighs> but the videos must go on because. Gotta build reputation. Even though you guys don't watch it all the way through. Tisk to tisk. I can see that. Everyone knows that cheese is the best health potion. If a man eats 15 cheese, like, like, wheel cheeses in front of you, cheeses, wheels of cheese in front of you, then, like, that's usually a sign you should not mess with them. Oh, there's three of you. Well, cool, I guess. Hmm. You guys don't really have the Christmas spirit going on right now, you know? Okay. We're just playing a really messed up game of Scooby-Doo right now, if you guys don't mind. Ooh, gold. Um... Come and chase me, boys. 
Am I? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Hmm. Interesting. What are you going to do? Maybe you should have done something like run away instead of just standing there and taking it to the face. I mean, that's a thought. But I suppose that may have been too brilliant for your simple mind to comprehend. Hmm. A basement. Hi. Well, I mean, kind of. Hmm. Mercenaries need to learn how to get better employers. Or these employers need better mercenaries. Either way, the deal is not being done properly. Hmm. Are you mentally insufficient? That didn't go the way you wanted it, did it? Oh, poor Elle. Hmm. Ah, yes. Mm, almost. There we go. Maybe I should go to the sewer. <sighs> this has been quite the episode. curiosity has me uh, in quite the position right now. Huh. 
Hmm, this oil seems kind of hot. Perhaps I shouldn't be walking on it. Yeah. Okay, let's go tell Brynjolf we're a good little boy. Oh my gosh, I'm so done with all of this stuff right now. Ugh. I just like really want like all the family that's in town right now gone <laughs> because I mean it's nice seeing them and all but like dot 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 not right now word travels fast I see what that might be right well i'll check my sources and speak to mercer but for now we're off to speak to maven blackriot he asked for you by name ah uh, that's not good if it was like that he wouldn't be asking for you he'd be calling on the gods rather though it's just business that's between don't worry about There we go, that's a good screenshot. Well, thank you for watching everyone. I really appreciate you sticking through and listening to me ramble as I explore and do quests. Now, I kind of understand that I haven't quite been as uh, humorous as usual. That's just because I've been exhausted with family arrangements and all that stuff and now that it's slowly coming to an end I might be able to actually relax and enjoy myself a little bit so until then thank you all for watching and have a fantastic